Okay, so I have to be honest. Normally on this channel, I like to give things away for free. The look on someone's face when you give them something and they realize that you mean it is a better feeling for me than when I get something for myself. That being said, I've bought a lot of stuff for myself lately. I wanted to make this room look more professional for my videos and my streams, so I did. I've been putting it off for a while because I've never felt good about spending any of this money on myself. However, I talked to a lot of you that actually show up to my streams and after enough encouragement, I finally did it. Obviously, there's still a lot of crap back here, but it's almost done. So since I'm out quite a bit of money, for the foreseeable future, I will not be giving away anything for free. The sponsor of this video is mine. And before you click away, you need to pay attention because this service helped me avoid something very scary. You see, anytime you sign up for a newsletter or make a purchase online, which we all do, companies get your name, your email, your address, and your financial information. Mine is a service that helps you discover your digital footprint and helps you remove your information from services that you no longer use, thus reducing your exposure and helping you avoid digital risks. By reclaiming your legal right to be forgotten, you can permanently delete data held by different companies. It's pretty crazy to see services that I haven't used in over five years still have access to my information. One of these companies that still had my information would have actually put me at a huge risk for a large purchase that I need to make coming up this year. If I did not have mine, this would have actually been very, very bad for me and my family. This is how it works. If you decide to reclaim your data from a company, an official data subject request is required for companies to fulfill your request they need to validate your identity to make sure they're not deleting someone else's data by mistake. By allowing mine to send emails on your behalf, an email with a deletion request will automatically be sent to the relevant companies from your email address. I really hope I don't have to go on to continue to explain the importance of a service like this. And the best part is if you go to saymine.com right now, it is actually available for free use. Later on, that will not be the case and you will have to pay a subscription. So make sure to check out mine, go to saymine.com right now and make sure you know where your data is. So I've had this idea for a while. How do I sell a gaming PC for $1. Obviously, if I just post an ad selling a computer for a dollar, they're gonna be hella vultures going for it. So I made it a little bit more difficult. I posted an ad that has all of the specs that says, must come to my house, cash only. Now for someone like me, when someone says must come to the house, I get incredibly hyped. Cause I know that means if you sell me broken parts, I know where you live. So I can politely and appropriately ask for my money back obviously. But to most people, it's a very derailing factor. A lot of people would rather meet in a public place like a gas station or a store because it makes them feel safer. Now, nowhere in the listing did I put the price. On some websites where it demands me to put the price, I did jokingly put in a dollar, but the rest of the ad reads as you gotta have some type of cash to get this thing. The reason I'm doing that is because that I know with the current situation and the lack of available parts, people are just going to buy whatever is available. And that's because everything that has been selling PC-wise just sells out immediately. And the other computer flippers that live here and across the United States are driving up the parts of secondhand parts like crazy. So I've decided if you can't beat them, join them. It's time to scam someone out of their hard earned money. So I got a text from a few people, all of them flaking, except for one. They'll be coming over in a few hours, but before they do, this is what they're buying. This is the PC from the last video. This is the PlayStation 5 console killer. Something like this normally retails for $800, but we were able to build it for around 500. This is a somewhat recreatable build, and if you want to build it for yourself, I highly recommend it. It is possible even during these times, and I will leave links to all the parts in the description. But for those of you that didn't see the video, here is the breakdown. Inside this PC, we have a Ryzen 5 1600 processor. This thing is plenty for editing, streaming, and more than enough for everyday tasks. We have an RTX 2060. It is the XC version by EVGA, which is the minimal version of the RTX card, but it is still a very powerful graphics card. And honestly, for the $500 that we were trying to spend to build this thing, it's insane value. If you've seen any of the benchmarks on this graphics card, then you would know that if you have this in your system, you are in for more than a pleasant gaming experience, and you can even stream off of it if you wanted to. For the RAM, we have eight gigabytes of DDR4 RAM running at 2666 megahertz. I know, 
not the fastest speed RAM for Ryzen processors. However, the motherboard is an A320 and this was the fastest frequency RAM that the motherboard could support. So we might as well make the most of our money and get that RAM. For the case, this is a Corsair 275R. This is the airflow version. You can tell by the ugly grill in the front. The only reason we're using this case specifically is because to get another case shipped here takes approximately three to four weeks. And this is the case that I had available after shattering the tempered glass. At this point, I look at it as recycling. And then for the SSD, we have a 240 megahertz 240 gigabyte ssd in this system which is enough for windows as well as a few games all in all this is a very powerful system and if you haven't seen any of the benchmarks feel free to check out the last video because you will see that this really is a great pc for gaming and it can be even more than that if you want to be productive or do just about anything else and considering the high price that i am selling this computer for i would say it's a pretty good deal. Anyways, they're going to be here in a little bit, so I have to finish setting up. Huh? I'm going. Okay, good, good. Uh, well, okay. So the idea is like, obviously I want this to be more hidden because there's no way, I don't, there's, there's like no way for me to get a microphone over there with the cameras. Uh, there isn't, right? <sighs> I hate Sony cameras. Okay. Well, so. Uh, nothing, nothing out of the normal, <laughs> nothing out of the ordinary here. So, <laughs> um. Damn boy, he thick! That, this isn't, this isn't weird, right? Every, yeah, this is my, this is my nipple. Are you gonna make fun of my, my, imp my impinged nipple? <laughs> okay. Okay, how's that? So I just have to, so tell me, tell me when you start to hear a little disconnect. Hello, hello, hello. Yes, got a lavalier microphone strapped to my chest with a receiver strapped to my, did any of that cut out? Nope. Really? Perfect. Dude, it's the farther I put it down. Yep. All right, cool. And now we just, now we wait. Now we wait. So, uh, this, this is the computer. Um, if you want to check it out or mess with anything. So what, what is it you were looking to do on the computer? Uh, anything. I don't know. Just, uh, you know, like, a, a little bit of gaming or surfing the internet, watching videos, emails, all that stuff? Yeah. And okay. And uh, I, like, I, I, I download all my little casino games. That's all I play. Okay, okay. Yeah, for my sure. Sister, my sister, my, my uh, daughter and her boyfriend, they played a little, but they had things on the head, play against other people. Right, okay. They ain't going to use it online. Ah. <laughs> they own, they want to do something like that. Okay. So this, this computer is capable of doing everything uh there's pretty much not anything i can see that you won't be able to do on it but uh if you want to be able to test or check it out right now so i don't know what i'm doing if i do it so okay yeah I no did, problem i did the one that comes and hooks stuff up for me let me know got you all i know how to do is turn it on and move that mouse up. <laughs> i got you well i just wanted to show a few, showcase a few things so inside the computer uh there are a few things there's the, the graphics card. This is what handles all the images and if all the casino games that'll be handled on the graphics card. Um, this is the processor with the fan right here. Um, both are very powerful. They'll be able to do a lot more than what it sounds like you're gonna use it for. Uh -huh. So if you ever need, if someone ever needs a computer in the house, they're like, oh, I need something powerful, then this will be able to handle that. This is what the look of the computer is. I hope I hope this is okay. Yeah, um, cool me. I mean, all I need is something just to download pictures and. I guess like scrapbook and things. Well, I got a whole lot of pictures on, on my zip drives and stuff. Yeah. And stuff, so I just want to download them, organize them and stuff like that. Yeah, for so, sure. No problem. Yeah, this, this so, will be able to handle all that. I can uninstall some stuff in here, but this is, so this is the part that you're going to be buying. Um, so what, uh, the price wise, uh, would we agree on? 500. 500? Okay. Um, let's see. Cause the re the retail, the retail of a system like this is, uh, is like around 800. Um, I don't think I can do 500. Um, let me see. Is, is this 500 what you'd be comfortable paying? Yeah, that's what I did told me. So oh, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Um, all right, well, 
I can't do 500, but how about this? Um, how about, how about, uh, how about one? How about one? Would one be okay? One what? Uh, one dollar. Would one dollar work? Yeah. So you could, so you could, uh, you could do a dollar. A dollar would be fine. Yeah, I could do a dollar. Be fine. All right, fine. Let me see it. I'll take the dollar. <laughs> let me check. Hold on. Let me check this real quick. I need to make sure. So, uh, I I understand that you know through everything that's going on in the world right now. Uh huh. It sucks. Like with you know like jobs availability and people worrying about money and stuff like that. And I don't know if you know this, but a lot of people who sell computers like me, um, they're jacking the prices up of everything. Why? Oh, because you can't buy anything. It, it kind of makes me mad. So kind of what I, what I wanted to do is I wanted to see if, uh, I wanted to see if I could try to make it so that people don't always have to worry about like an extra dollar or stuff like that. So while I, while I appreciate that you were willing to pay, what was it, the 500 for this computer? Uh-huh. I'll take the $1, and then you can have the computer, so you can do oh, whatever you need with it. Oh, uh, No, nah, <laughs> not really. But I'll take, actually, I'll put this right here. <laughs> yeah, oh, good Lord. Hell yeah, I could do that. Yeah, dude, no worries. Really? I'll take the, yeah. I'll take oh, the one dollar for the PC. You. No worries. Oh yeah. man! But you only get this. I get to keep the butter. Oh, no. <laughs> they got me all this right here. He can uh -huh. give me a uh, monitor and this other stuff. Okay, dope. No, that's nice. So yeah, we'll set you up with this thing, and uh, I'll keep the dollar, and you keep the PC. Oh yeah, that's cool, man. Oh man, thank you. <laughs> no worries, man. <laughs> all right. As I'm editing this video, I realized I forgot to shoot an outro. Anyways, huge shout out to Perry. Thank you so much for, you know, agreeing to be a part of the video and just, you know, um, making that experience happen. That was really cool. I hope wherever you are, I hope you enjoy the computer. And to those of you watching, I hope you found this creative, entertaining, or informative in any way, shape, or form. And as always, have a great day. I'm not gonna be